Welcome to YoungHollywood.com. We're here at the Beach Body House, sponsored by Silver Spoon, where we're about to get beach ready with Danity Kane. Hey, Young Hollywood, this is Aubrey from Danity Kane, and I'm getting my hair did. For translation, that means getting my hair done. <laughs> this is Andrea from Danity Kane. I'm here at the beach house getting my hair done by Michael. He's using Unite Thick Finishing Wax. <laughs> this is Shannon Bex. It's fun to be pampered or get your hair done and get new makeup ideas and seeing what the latest fashions are. So I'm just chilling. We were formed on Making the Bound on MTV through Sean Diddy Combs. We've been going strong for almost two years now. But my experience on Making the Band was a huge growing experience. I went into it barely 21. It's four years later now. I mean, I think I really, really grew up at that through the whole process. You know, I came from, from home. I had never been on a plane anywhere, so I went to New York by myself to really toughen my skin. Christina Aguilera, the Back to Basics tour. I think we were through 41 cities. My favorite part about touring with Christina would definitely be meeting our fans. Probably the second thing would be performing at Madison Square Garden. We were all so excited that night. Bad Boy and Atlantic acted like they weren't even gonna come and then they all showed up and presented us with our platinum plaques. And just to be on that, I mean, I'm getting chills right now, just to be on that stage and to receive platinum plaques for an album that all of us really believed in, it was just an amazing feeling. It definitely made us feel like legitimate artists. I think a lot of people are really confused by it being like something so glamorous and it's, it's really not. It's like 4 a.m. call times and you just got off a plane and like Shannon's right there telling me. It's a lot, a lot of hard work. It's a lot of no sleeping and, you know, being away. But once you get on that stage and you're in front of that huge crowd and they're screaming, it just really is worth it. The next big thing is recording studio for our sophomore album. That's it. It's a wrap.